Seminole villages are built on patches of high, dry ground called hammocks, which rear themselves sporadically in the swamp. Each village is composed of one family. Its size depends on the number of married daughters, for it is the custom of the tribe that husbands live with their in-laws. Their huts are called chiquis, and they are so built that when the hurricane howls about the hammock, the winds will pass through. Great houses fall before the hurricane, but the chiqui remains standing. Seminole women are famous for their statuesque appearance and quiet dignity. Tribal law forbids them to speak to white people, though rarely does a white man visit their village. They scale garfish, speared by the men. Though inedible, its silver armor is a rich prize. These scales will be boiled, bleached, and sold to white traders for eventual use as sequins. The children are handsome, but strangely quiet. Perhaps their silence is the result of their heritage, for in the dark years when the tribe was hunted, children were trained from infancy never to betray their presence. <laughs> 